That time, Hogue controls it. Sanders gives it straight back to him. And he gets on the board. Canadian middle blocker. One of our players to watch. Look at that spike height, 3.12 meters. Chebul for Slovenia again on Hogue. Hogue solves the problem again. This time with a tip. Played a lot last season as an opposite, where he had a chance to really work on that serve. Canada, some confusion after defence. That's a great shot from Tonchekster. And look at how much a hair behind on there, and if he could have gotten it to a bit quicker, it might have changed things. Heron goes again against Kovacic, and this time Stern can go off the arms down the line. So really smart there from Sebel. Nice control from Perrin against that strong serve. <laughs> Top spill, a tape serve. It's a great touch by Rob Red and defense by Ornald. Perrin has to set in transition. That's on it, Stan. Canada win the joust and Hogue gets the tip into the middle of the court. Because, you know, you're kind of, it's almost like a, you're guessing if slow. It's also a block substitution. Setter goes out. And that time, Hogue from position two goes over the top. <laughs> Hogue had a great rotation there in the front row. We saw a couple strong. This time on their own reception. Remember, the, ring, the receiving team has the advantage in volleyball. And that's why. Stern against one block. Takes the first set for Slovenia, 25-21. Hogue handles that one well. And the serve doesn't keep him out of the attack is to prevent the pipe attack and it did not another good serve from Perrin this time forcing the overpass Stern there's not too much top spin on that certainly not enough for Marshall to be able to predict its flight Van Berkel with the top spin hybrid serve, but Stern from position one finds the space between the blockers. Defense there, but here, as you can see, definitely a seam in the block, and both Perrin and Sam. Perrin again controls it, and Hogue goes over the top of Pop Red. Look at this again, another in system pass. Good defense <laughs> reception from Marshall. All of the aces in the match have come from Slovenia. One of them for Stern. This is going to be a triple block against Hogue, and he finds the space. And you can see a great triple block from Slovenia. Hogue just gets up there. Man Canada stay in touch. Taking his father's advice. Nice. Get that serve going. It was an overbump, and I'm, I'm surprised that Hogue, yep, there, he made an adjustment as the serve happened. He just took an extra step over, but amazing job there, switching up the positions on serve. Why receivers change? Everybody stepped to their left, and then he played the short serve to position two. 
Blackburn and Evans take something off that serve. Which turn goes off Lepke and out of court. And Slovenia comfortably win the second set, 25-19. Our set point. The first person in action is Alan Pyank, starting the third set. Slovenia leading 2-0. Oh, oh, that time, oh, Stern was in better position against Vernon Evans. Calling that a monster block, but watch Stern just push his hands, like not too far over. Another net tape. This time, Sanders goes back to Perrin. And that's a really good attack from Stern. The weakest part of the block is the just over the tape. And two aces. Will he add to that? Very, very nearly. There's that scoop again from Hoag. This time kept it in play. And Stern gets the reward. Seta gave it back to him. He was the one that created the free ball opportunity. But Canada ended up giving up a free ball. And I was surprised that Vernon Evans didn't just crank that. You know, given that you're down two sets to none, start taking more risks. Marshall controlled that. And so Hogue has a chance to play that. Jansen Van Dorn. Flight serve doesn't cause too many problems. Hogue gets one block back against Tonchek Stern. small tiny little adjustments to get the ball up well controlled by Sanders great serve from Schwartz that's what Hogue wants he wants better defense from his middles that's for sure Canada have a two-point break. Perrin that time takes something off it. Kozimanik is out of the receives it, is out of the play, but Stern just eases that. Righty from Stern in this matchup, especially with the pace of his ball. Even that one, he kind of took some heat off of it, which can sometimes cause some issues for blockers. That could have easily been a free ball given up to the Canadians, but Slovenia took advantage. And has that line really well in his sights. That time, Hogue. He's going to need to make a change with Canada leading 14-11. it back across his body. Watch this. Goes down the line, takes advantage of that space. Kozimanik went with the top spin last time. Aaron goes in front of Hope to receive that time. And Mozic nearly controls that. Block from Bornard. Good defense from Stern. He knew that the offense was restricted. <laughs> Mozic wanted to hit that. And there was a 100% chance that ball was going to playing at the end of that long rally. And that they just snuck that past him. hard with that, ends up with a high ball with Stern, and he pushes that off Hogue's hands. It's a great use, it's a great tool there by Stern. Nice pass from Hornard. Stern steps onto that so fast. Just a fantastic attack. Stern is so dynamic. And 
at the first time of asking. The next serve on home, home over passes it. And Slovenia are very, very happy. Yeah, they were in, in this match. They had the composure, they had the control. They were always on the service line, putting tough balls into the Canadians, making it really challenging for Canada and the serve receivers to get in system. Canada couldn't, they didn't have.